guys, Danny with the Dream Clients Accelerator here. And if you're looking for a video that's going to show you how to make money on ClickBank, even as a complete beginner for free, then you're in the right place. This video is loaded with value, guys, and I'm going to walk you through step by step the best way to get started. I'm going to reveal to you everything that you need to know to be successful with ClickBank as an affiliate. So make sure that you stick around for the whole video because I'm going to be sharing the free traffic strategies I currently use. They're working incredibly well for me right now. Now, really quick, if you are brand new to the channel, guys, my name is Danny Skulls. I'm with the Dream Clients Accelerator. And on this channel, I teach people how to make money online, specifically with affiliate marketing and passive income streams. You know, I've got a ton of videos here on how you can start your online business with digital marketing and of course how you can grow your brand with YouTube and TikTok so if you guys want to learn more please make sure that you do subscribe to the channel you know the main goal of my channel is to help you build a passive income business so go ahead and hit subscribe click the bell notification so you never miss any of my trainings because we pretty much put up maybe one to two new videos each week on the channel Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you the secrets, you know, the real secrets that you need to know to be successful on ClickBank as a beginner in 2022 and even beyond. Um, we're going to cover the hottest markets that you should be in that'll help you make the most money as possible. I'm going to actually walk you through an example of how to choose the right product, and we're going to cover several free traffic methods that you could begin using today, guys. And also, you're going to learn the best way to promote these other products from people so that way you can build a referral business and a sustainable online income instead of just having some kind of short-term success. So again, before we start in this channel, I release one to two new videos each week with different ways to help you make money online from home. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss any of the future videos. And why not? While you're here, go ahead and hit the like button on this video before we get started. All right, so before we get into the secrets, guys, that really make all of this work, let's quickly break down why ClickBank is such a great affiliate network for you to partner with. Okay, number one, it's the world's largest digital marketplace with over 4,000 digital products that you can promote. And they've paid out over $5 billion in commissions to different affiliates all over the world over the last 20 plus years. Now, ClickBank is also available to over 200 different countries around the world. They have a reliable payment system by either check, direct deposit, goes right into your bank account. And with some of these products, guys, you can get paid commissions as high as 75% or even higher. I mean, some of the smartest marketers in the world are selling on ClickBank. And I personally know people who've made millions of dollars using ClickBank as well. So we're gonna quickly go through how you could sign up to get your links, how to choose a profitable market, how to pick a high converting product within that market. So this way you really don't waste any of your time. So if you're ready, let's dive in. Okay, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. So let's go over what we're gonna cover in this video. Okay, we're gonna cover the six steps that you need to know to be successful. We're also gonna cover the three things that you should be avoiding if you wanna make real sustainable online income. So let's break it down. Here are the six steps that we're gonna cover in this video. Step one, we're gonna help you create your ClickBank account. Step two, we're gonna go over the hot hottest markets three we're going to show you how to choose your customer avatar number four how to pick a winning product number five how to promote for free without a website and number six the best way to build your online business so it's really sustainable for the long term okay so here are some quick things that you really should avoid guys i mean number one please do not spam your links all over the internet just don't be a spammer it doesn't work guys you know you're most likely going to get your accounts blocked or banned from most of these social media platforms it honestly isn't going to help you um, and if you're using words like scam and fraud in your marketing it's really never a good idea because we want to be working smarter guys not harder okay so let's walk through how to create your account 
and we'll get right into that. So you go to clickbank.com and then what you want to do is click on sign up. Okay. Um, you know, and if your page looks a little different than what you see here on the screen, that's okay. You're just looking for the actual sign up link and click on that. And then you're going to see right there, uh, you pick the country, you just click on that. You can choose the country that you're in. You add your details, your first name, last name, phone number, email and stuff, create your password. Okay. And that's it. I mean, you're going to have an account. So once you get in there, you could set up your payment methods, right? Add in your details and everything. And, you know, if you have any questions, just feel free to ask me in the comments. I'll be happy to walk you through it, guys. Okay. Um, so I could show you how to really get all the answers to anything you need. So we, once we get started here, um, we go in and we're looking for the actual marketplace. And that looks like this. Okay. So this is the marketplace. And this is where you're going to find these different products that you can start to promote. And it might look a little basic to you, but honestly, it's pretty much looked the same since back in 2007. They've really never updated the look of it, which is fine, honestly, because the key here is to realize there's a lot of very high converting products that they offer. They pay great commissions and you can make a lot of money with ClickBank, okay? So you can just kind of sort of ignore this page for now. I mean, I'm gonna show you the fastest ways. So if you scroll down on this page, you can see that they have different markets, right? For pretty much any type of product arts and entertainment, as seen on TV, betting systems, et cetera, et cetera. So you're probably asking what are the best markets to go into? These are the top three um, that you really wanna focus on. Number one would be health and fitness, especially right now at the start of the year in 2022. You know, everyone's kind of going into this looking to make a transformation, right? It's that mindset of the new year, new me. So that's really hot in the market right now. So all you would do is click on that box and you could see there's different categories within health and fitness, for example, right? And I'll get into explaining how you could find the hottest products in just a second. Okay, the next would be like make money online or e-marketing. This has been hot forever and it will always be hot forever, you know, especially with like affiliate marketing, right? You could see that that's in there as well. Um, it's really all about different types of online marketing and how to make money online, which is a really huge market to be into. And then the third one, uh, you know, it's really mindset or self-help, okay? And within the self-help, you have a lot of different things. There's dating, marriage, relationships, right? Um, things about children, being a better parent, things of that nature, um, and even like confidence and limiting beliefs and mindset stuff. So for me, those are the three hottest markets that I would say you should start in. Honestly, I think the two hottest of them would be health and fitness and making money online. Okay. So you just pick one of those um, that you're really more interested in. So let's say if you're interested in making money online, then you really like that topic, then you would pick that and you would really dive down. If you're more interested into health and fitness and losing weight, then obviously you would go with that as well, okay? Because you wanna find something that you have an interest in because it's gonna help you with your marketing efforts over the long term. You know, it's really hard to promote stuff if you're not interested in it. So those are the hottest markets. There's a couple of ways to find the hottest products as well. I mean, one, if you just kind of come up here to the search, you click on that automatically it's going to show you the highest converting products that are out right now that's the fastest way and you could see right there there's a lot of like supplements diet plans workout plans in the health and fitness right so um again obviously that's health and fitness related stuff it is very popular on clickbank that's one way uh, another way is just to go to the category you picked right and then you would click there and then you could say let's click on like affiliate marketing right if it was make money online and then you go up to the top and you'll see all the hottest products you can promote. These are high converting products by rank or what they call gravity, okay? And as an affiliate, you wanna make sure that there's an affiliate page that has good resources that you can get. You know, whether it's like different swipe emails, if you have an email list, you can get images to use in your social media content. That's stuff that you should be looking out for. You know, you also wanna look out for what they call like a JV page, right? A joint venture page, which requires your email and they just really wanna follow up with you via email. So do that with uh, them as well. You know, ClickBank also has a lot of different pages that they update regularly. 
they tell you what are the hottest products. So for example, there's a page that has like the top 10 best eBiz affiliate programs in 2022. And that'll list all the current programs that are converting. There's also another page for weight loss affiliate programs, right? So just kind of skim through that page, look for the hottest products, you know, uh, in whatever category you choose. So you can look at that as well, but it's really important to just focus in on one market for now, guys, to start with. So let's say if we choose health and fitness, we're going to choose that. And then we focus on the market. Okay. Once we do that and we look for a product that's converting, you want to pick a product that has really high payouts. So you can look through and see some of these that they pay over a hundred dollars for every sale guys. Right. Um, so let's say you pick some of the supplements. So if we decided like, we're going to go to promote these, we would look to see who they're targeting right? Are they targeting men over a certain age or women over a certain age? That's really important to understand. It's really who your avatar is. So for example, if we click on one that's like marketing to women, right? Now it's about getting specific. And the more specific we can get on who our target customer is, the better we can be and the better results we can get. So for example, if it's a, a woman 30 and over with children who's maybe a little overweight, doesn't have a lot of energy or time, right? Uh, aside from dealing with the kids and life and stuff. Once we know that, we can then, you know, find a product that can actually help them and create content and marketing that solves that problem. So we're speaking directly to their pain points, okay? We wanna find out also where these people are online. Where are they hanging out? What type of Facebook groups? What type of content are they reading, looking at, right? We have to look at where these people are, where we can find them, because we want to be able to market the product to them, okay? And if we're not doing something like paid ads, we have to think of these free methods and how we could do that. So at this point, we've got a product to promote. We know who we're going to promote it to. So now let's talk about how we're going to find these people, okay? What free traffic methods we can use. Uh, and I'm going to get a little bit more deeper as we go through it. So, you know, there's some common ones, of course. Um, that you're probably already familiar with. And again, these are free methods you can use that we're gonna cover. So number one, I mean, you can have like a free WordPress blog uh, on wordpress.com. And I want you to know, honestly, blogs, they don't work like they used to. So I wouldn't totally recommend that as your first choice. I mean, it is a good strategy to use. I definitely would input it into my marketing strategy, but my first choice, number one, would probably be something like YouTube. Okay. Now I know a lot of you are probably hesitant because you don't want to be on camera like I am right now, but I'm telling you there's different ways you can do this. There's a lot of different channels out there that honestly don't even show their face. They're just making a voiceover and they're using stock footage. Okay. And stock footage are clips that you see on many of my other videos. Um, these aren't actual video clips that I've recorded. I go to a different, you know, different sites. One of the ones that I use all the time is pexels.com, for example, and I'll just find some stock footage that's copyright free that I can download that fits the narration of my video. And then you could just basically write a little script, create a voiceover, find some clips to use, throw the video up on YouTube. And there's a lot of very successful channels here, guys, where they never even appear on camera. You never see these people's faces. These sites have huge huge followings. They're getting tons of traffic. No one is ever appearing in the video. It's literally just stock footage with a voiceover. So that's one way you can do it with YouTube, right? It might take you a month or two to really kick off and start seeing some traction. YouTube is something you have to be patient with, guys. It's not a get rich quick type of thing. You really need to be focusing on long term. Okay. Number two would be uh, Facebook groups. You know, you would create your own Facebook group and you'd start to post content in there. You could go live, make trainings, right? Uh, you'd be growing that over time. That's another method. I mean, also we could use Instagram and with Instagram, I love it because you don't even have to appear on camera. You can literally just use informational posts about the products, motivational quotes, right? You can have lists like the top 10 ways to lose weight, the top 10 ways to make money. You can have all these different kinds of informational graphics that you can use. Even with uh, sites like Pinterest, right? You can create these top 10 posts and then directly link your affiliate product in the photo description or in the video pin. Same thing goes for TikTok. I mean, honestly, TikTok and YouTube for me have been some of the hottest traffic sources. 
Um, I've got some 10 second videos on TikTok with over 100,000 views. I mean, just in the last three months since starting my TikTok, I've generated over $15,000 in commissions, guys, offering different types of products, right? Uh, TikTok isn't just a kid's platform. It's not just for dancing videos anymore. Now, remember, you don't have to show your face. You can do a voiceover if you feel more comfortable. You could use infographics. There's a lot of different ways for marketing that works. Just spamming a funnel or spamming forms, you know, is not always going to be the end all. The real key is to just not promote your offer, but it's also to provide value, right? Think of my YouTube channel, how many free trainings I put out or in my Facebook group or on my TikTok page. It's not just about selling all the time. You want to think of problems that your clients may be facing, how you can solve those problems with value to build trust, which is going to turn into sales. Okay. Let's talk about how to really grow your business. Um, if you want to do this properly, it makes more sense to use what we call an affiliate bridge funnel. And how that works is instead of just sending your traffic from whatever link you put in your bio or description, right, to the actual sales page of the product you're promoting, what you're doing instead is you're sending what's called a lead capture page. You would have a lead magnet, you know, that you know that your avatar would be in. Like if you're in weight loss, it could be get this free ebook on the top 10 ways to lose weight. Right. They get and in exchange for giving that to them, they sign up with their email. Then you can begin to follow up with them with an automated email sequence, which you could build out of like 10 or 15 pre written emails as many as you honestly want to put in there. And with this automation, you could start to begin to build a relationship with the prospect because guys understand people don't usually buy on the first time they see something. You know, it takes at least seven touch points in many cases for someone to build trust and then to actually purchase. So if you send people directly from, you know, your TikTok or YouTube to a sales page, you know, let's say you send 100 people there, you might make one sale, right? But if you have an email follow up sequence and you follow up with them several times, you might make five to 10 sales for every offer you put out. So it's going to make a huge difference in the long term and in your marketing. OK, so put these people onto your email list, um, you know, and even again with different social media sites, you got to understand they change their algorithms all the time. Google does it all the time. TikTok's doing it all the time. Right. Um, so, you know, something that's working today may not be working for you next month. So if you don't have an email list, you know, that business is really not doing well in the long term. I mean, you might just end up coming to a point where you make money one month, next month you don't, right? It's happened to me before and it's happened to a lot of people I know in the industry. So the smartest thing for you to do is to get people onto your email list. That way you're creating a digital real estate that you now own, okay? That way you always have that resource in place where you can just go in, send out emails about any offers to your list. You can also promote multiple offers throughout the, the life cycle that someone's on your list. You don't have to just promote one product, right? I mean, if I can get someone to buy one product, why can't I get them to buy five or 10 over the course of time, right? So, you know, again, you could start by sending like three to five emails about one particular product. Then you could add some free value posts and free content in your email, some free training, right? Then you could do another three to five emails about a different product, all related in the same market. So this way, if let's say your email is about health and fitness, right, all these products would be within that niche. And you'd be talking about these things that your prospect is interested in. Hopefully that's starting to make sense, guys. Um, that's basically the sustainable way to create an online business. It's really to leverage the power of email marketing. And we could talk about more of that in the future videos. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, make sure you do smash that like button and turn on the bell notification. OK, uh, I'll also put a link below in the description of the video where you can get access to my free book on the seven steps to high ticket affiliate marketing. OK, uh, it's going to give you some really good tips and insights. So check that out as well. At the end of the video, it'll be in the description. So let's give you a couple more tips, right? So as I talked about earlier, one of my main free traffic sources right now is TikTok. And you might have these preconceived ideas, right? I mean, I know, honestly, I didn't want to get on TikTok at first. I, I really was late to the party because I always felt it was just wasn't for me. Something that young people were doing, people were just dancing, right? But I want you to understand when I focused on providing value and speaking to my market directly, I had my first thousand followers 
course in week one. I was able to add a link to my bio. I had the ability to start going live and you get that once you hit your first thousand followers. Okay. Um, so that way you could start to offer your lead magnets and grow your email list. So that would be my number one traffic source right now that I would really recommend you start with. Um, I've actually been able to get more email signups faster on TikTok than I've been able to grow my YouTube. And it's a fast way to build your email list. And then once people are on that list, you can start to use your emails to send people over to your YouTube, over to your Instagram, to join your Facebook group. That way you can really build the relationship even further, okay? Now, I also did talk about a WordPress blog earlier. It is great as a long-term strategy to have your own website with your own blog, uh, because then you could write articles, you can do product reviews, right? Different types of pop-ups that are promoting on your blog, and that'll help you build your email list faster as well. So these are all helpful tips, and I know that, you know, these are free strategies, and you're probably looking for like a faster way. Honestly, the only faster way is to do paid traffic, but if you don't know what you're doing, you can lose a lot of money doing paid ads, guys. I definitely suggest you start with these free methods to really build up your brand, to build up your content, to build up social proof, right, that we talked about earlier in the video. Um, and then start with one at first because it can be overwhelming trying to learn like a new platform, right? I mean, there's lots of videos that you could check out. I mean, I have one on YouTube that I did on TikTok training. It's really in-depth and it'll help you start to hit the ground running. So if you want to see that video about TikTok and the other strategies I use, like I said before, subscribe to the channel, go through my playlist. This way you never miss any of the great training that I have. Okay. And you could use these strategies for Instagram reels or Pinterest, and you could have a YouTube channel. And then you slowly start to just really build it all out, concentrating around that one main niche that you're targeting. So if it's health and fitness, each of these channels would be about health and fitness, and you'd create content in order to attract your client avatar that's interested in getting a, a problem fixed, right? So hopefully that's starting to make sense. You pick a market, you pick someone in the market you're speaking to, and then your marketing revolves around what that person is struggling with. They're struggling to lose weight. They're struggling to learn how to make money online, whatever it is, right? This worked, this didn't work for them, that didn't work. They've tried different things. And now you have a clear way to address that pain point, find what they're struggling, figure out a, pro a solution to that problem. Okay. That's what I mentioned earlier. Um, so, you know, when you sign up with an affiliate program, make sure it's a quality product that actually helps people. You know, there's no faster way to end your business than promoting a product that's not very good. There's a lot of junk products that are out there. They're really not the greatest. So if you just promote anything without checking into it yourself, people aren't going to listen to you anymore. Once they buy one bad product from you and it's just complete garbage, they're going to unsubscribe from your email list. Um, and if you're looking to build a long-term relationship, you want to be putting free, helpful content out there. You want to be sending helpful products to your following and your subscribers. So that way they trust you. They look at you as an authority and they can confident click on the link to buy any product you promote and say, you know what? Thanks for sending me that. That was an amazing offer. You know, I put the $7 in, I got some great training out of it. I can't believe how good that was for something like that. So then you got to start thinking along those lines, right? Now you're probably thinking, uh, I'm just going to go spam my links. Like I said, there's so many people on TikTok that are doing that. They create an account. Every video is get this link, get this link, get this link, get this training, get this product. I mean, it seems like a free and easy way. And maybe, you know, you could be out there spamming in the comments and stuff, but it's really not a smart move to build a long-term sustainable business. You're going to burn out really quick. People are going to see what you're doing and they're just not going to want to stay on your channel if everything you put out is buy, 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 right? You want to build value, solve problems and become an authority. So again, who's in the market? Who are we targeting? What are their pain points? How can I help them to achieve their goals? And then really helping them to find the solutions to those problems, right? You know, I think affiliate marketing overall has a really bad reputation because people are just kind of really spammy about it a lot of times. People are generally lazy. So I'm telling you, don't be lazy, guys. Now, if you honestly want to check out the two high ticket 
programs I currently promote as an affiliate, and you can get access to all of my amazing bonuses, you can just click the two links in the video description. These are high ticket affiliate programs, right? So they pay me on average 75% or higher. So for each sale that I get with these, it could pay me sometimes $750 per sale, up to $1,100 for every referral that I bring in. Now remember, spanning never works, right? I wanna say that again. The stuff that I've taught you in this video is really all you need to know to get going. Sure, maybe you can get a little more deeper with some of the traffic tactics and the psychology behind building these emails and stuff, but these are the basics. You know, you go to ClickBank, you get a link, you pick a good market, you pick a hot product, you start promoting that product by speaking to your client's pain point through either paid traffic or free methods that we covered with YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, right? Um, and, you know, again, these are great methods to start with, right? For example, if you see that there's like a lot of women in the market for this product, Pinterest would be a good place to target them because 80% of the users on Pinterest are typically women. So you could have some weight loss type posts on Pinterest that go to your blog that then redirects them to your email list or your YouTube. So that's kind of how the whole strategy works, guys. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. You know, if you found this video helpful, hit the like button, smash the subscribe, hit the notification so you never miss my videos. And, uh, you know, I look forward to seeing you on the next training.